Hi friends, this is your colleague Mir Ali Khan. In this video tutorial, I'm about to show you how to add a non-Steam game into the Steam VR gaming application. To begin, you will have to first locate the application itself. There are three ways to do that. One, you can go to the search box at the on the taskbar at the bottom and type in Steam and look for the application. There's the application. Two, look for it on the taskbar itself if it's loaded already. And three, look for it on the desktop. Look for the I icon for the Steam VR on the desktop right here. I am going to double click on this to load the application. Once you load the application, now, under this page, you'll have four options, store, library, community, and your login option. For our purposes, we're going to stick with library. I'm going to click on that. And now I'm going to look for a plus icon and an add game at the bottom left corner. Once you see that, Click on the plus and a pop-up menu will come up. Browse the Steam store for games, act, activate a product on Steam, and add a non-Steam game. We are going to add a non-Steam game from locally on the computer. Click on non-Steam game. Once you click on it, a window will open up. Here you will browse for the application on the computer and then select it and then add it. Once you click the browse, a window will pop open up. I'm going to click on desktop and on desktop, I'm going to click locate and click on Luminous Builds 2. Double click and then I'm going to look for flushing and proving 2.04 R5RC4 folder. Double click the folder. Once you double click the folder, you will see four or five applications or, and or folders. The one that you're looking for is the flushing and proving 2.04 R5 RC4 EXE file. Click on that. Once you click on it, go down and click on open button. Once you open it, it will take you back to the Steam Engine page. Now, as you can see, flushing and proving training scenario has been added here and is selected. After it's been selected, I'm going to go down and click on Add Selected Programs. Once you do that, your scenario is added under the non-categorized section of the Steam VR. Always look for the added games and refer it to the number that you have added 2.0.4 R5 RC4 in our case here. Once you click on it, a play button will populate. Click on the play button and load the game. Once the game is loaded, a disclaimer page will populate. Here you are ready for your trainees to go through and experience the training scenario game in the Steam VR engine. Thank you so much. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you have any questions, feel free to contact me.